Hi, Anna here from miss-beatrix.blogspot.com sitting here with Beatrix herself who has been snoring and I just wanted to do a really quick vlog today to share with you a craft book that I picked up last week. Um, it's a crochet book and you're probably thinking Anna, you're always saying you can't crochet so why the hell did you buy a crochet book? Well, I got completely sold on it so I felt it was justified. Plus, if it motivates me to actually learn to crochet, then it wasn't a waste of money, was it? Um, it was from the works. I picked it up primarily to laugh at the title, because it's got a really silly title. But I do actually think the title is justified. It's called Super Super Cute Crochet by Bridget Reed. Discover 35 fun and fluffy friends to crochet. I paid £2.99 for it. And as I say, I picked it up to laugh at it and then just thought, this is coming home with me because there are some gorgeous projects inside this book. So I thought I'll just uh, flick through and show some of them to you. There is an arctic fox. Some of, them, some of the projects actually look needle felted because they're really fluffy. I think that's one of the really clever things about them. A silkworm. A silkworm. A silkworm some really unusual animals in here. I quite like that though because you do get your dogs and your cats in here. There's a rabbit, there's a guinea pig, which is one of the reasons I wanted the book. But there's also some really unusual animals as well. There's a panda. Let's have a look what else have we got. There's owls, there's a toucan, a bluebird, a butterfly. <laughs> there's an anteater as well. That's really sweet. I hope you can see these photos well enough. Um, the guinea pig is a hippo. There's a flamingo. There is... oh! An African land snail. <laughs> if you just imagine making one of those for your great aunt Mildred for Christmas and she unwraps it on Christmas Day and goes very nice dear, why have I been given a crocheted snail? Um, or even better, a duckbill platypus. I'm sure she'd be delighted with one of those. <laughs> I intend to make all these eventually and then send them anonymously to friends and family. Poor unsuspecting friends and family. <laughs> one of the better ones in this book is a shrimp. A crocheted shrimp. I think that's brilliant. You seem to have such a whimsical expression as well. There's a squid. I said it, I have to show it to you now. I can't just flick past it once I've said the word squid. Um, what else have we got? There is a stingray, a walrus, a very cheesy looking frog on a toad with lovely smiley faces. I think they're really nice. So you see what I mean? The title actually does justify itself because as I was flicking through this book I found myself going, that's so cute! I didn't say super super cute but I did think it was very cute. Um, there's baby turtles in here. Probably my favourite project in the whole book is the baby penguin. Now that is super super cute. Um, one more. Um, oh, 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 it has to be. Very faulty towers, this one. Siberian hamster. I don't know if she means Syrian hamster, because didn't Manuel have a Siberian hamster in faulty towers that was actually meant to be a rat? Anyway, um, if you can get this book for 2 99 then it's an absolute bargain, definitely buy it, even if you can't crochet like me, um, just for the pictures, or you could learn to crochet and join me in a little online group of learning to crochet. Um, I will have a look and see if it's on Amazon as well, I forgot to do that before I started this video, and if it is then I'll link to it below, but it did originally retail at $19.95, so it's got to be a bargain wherever you get it from. So yeah, that's my recommendation. Um, one that just turned up through my door this morning um, is how to make jewellery with Tati Divine. Probably won't review this one because it's been out a while now, I um, can't remember exactly when, um, but it seems to have been absolutely everywhere on craft blogs so um, if anyone wants me to review it I'll happily do so, just uh, bob me a comment or an email and let me know. Um, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to curling up with a cup of tea and looking at that one later. So, yep, yeah, craft bargains all round. Um, I got the Tatty Divine one from the book people, and they're also really good for craft books if you haven't come across them. So, that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye!